remember this viral video of the American flag at the fry and pan tower being torn apart during winds from Hurricane Dorian. Well, Monday storms caused another American flag to be torn apart. And here is Richard Neal bringing that flag down on the next day, Tuesday. Richard Neal is there taking it down and he rode out the storm Monday in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean that's 34 miles off the coast of North Carolina. I had the chance to speak with Richard yesterday. He is there right now and a new flag is already up flying. We were taking a look on Monday outside the flag that's just up there just sort of flapping away. Suddenly started going absolutely nuts and uh, I don't know if we got any video of that, uh, that sort of thing, but the waves kept picking up and tearing up. He gave me a little tour there on the chat yesterday, but he said the scariest part actually were the wa or the waves, and you can see them here. They lowered down a GoPro, got video of the waves, 20-foot waves. He said it would uh, cause the tower to shake. This tower, though, sits 65 feet up in the air, so they didn't have any problems. He said he was a little nervous, though, Bill Ray. And <laughs> I, like I said earlier, it kind of looks like the perfect storm waves. If you had the chance to go here, would you go? Um, yeah, not for a long time. Yeah, I, I think it would be kind of cool that they, they could give tours out to, on a helicopter and let yeah. you land there, but I don't think I'd want to stay as long as he is. That would get claustrophobic. They used to have Airbnb out there, not anymore. Yeah, They're I read about that. Yeah, and then he took it over. Yeah, so there was a way you could do that. Yeah, somehow you want to touch the sand every once in a while if you're going to the beach. <laughs> exactly.